What's going on guys? Welcome back to Dying Light. So today we have to go and introduce ourselves to Race. And uh, yesterday I was saying that I wanted to take a little while to sort of learn the game a little more. Can you hear me? Jade? I can yeah, hear you. I copy. Something wrong? No, no, it's... Um... Listen, Crane. We all appreciate what you're doing. And I know you're doing it to redeem yourself. Because Amir died saving your life. Look, I'm doing it because if we don't get Antis in from Rice, people will start to die. You know, I met Amir right after the outbreak. I didn't know him for that long, but he was the, best, hear this? the most decent man I've ever known. But I just want you to know that I don't blame you. Amir needs a risk. And Craig, we know that you too are taking a risk to do this for us. I, look, Jade. We'll talk when I get back with the antizen, okay? I love how you can smash people on the floor on this game. So, some of you kindly pointed out a few things to me. One was that kicking is my best friend. And, uh, yeah, you can sort of use that to kick stuff into, like, pointy objects. Also, some of you were pointing out how I can uh, craft lockpicks and stuff. But, yeah, I kind of got my head around that yesterday when I was playing for a little while. I think I missed the uh, tutorial for crafting. But it's all good. It's not a problem. Some really sick runs on this game. But, anyway, we're going to meet Race today. I think to open there. Why not? smash that open. Try and look out for some lockboxes because I know they've got some sweet weapons in and uh, I want to see what's in some of them. I want to lockpick some of those guys open. I wonder if I can jump out here and onto that bastard. Oh, I, I could get on the roof and do it but I kind of want to do it from here. Ah! Ah! I don't know if like the blue things are like you don't well, you don't take damage or they break your fall or whatever. The sort of blue platforms. So it's, it's how I feel about it just because of Mirror's Edge. I don't know if any of you play that but the red and blue things are sort of key. And uh... Yeah, UV lights, all that stuff for night time. Let's get my head around that a little bit. We haven't really braved that out too much yet. But let's just keep jogging on towards the race for now. I'll try and look out for a couple of those luck boxes. Should we kick a bitch into one of these? I kind of want to do that. I haven't kicked anyone into this yet. Okay, man. Is there another one around? Is it just this guy? I hear planes. Just this guy, I think. I'm going to kick you back, buddy. Come on. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Getting impaled today, my friend. Oh, no. Thank you. So that saves your weapons. That's kind of a cool idea. I like that. Right, so race is quite a way off by the looks of things. So jog on past all of these guys. What's going on, guys? <laughs> oh, God. So if you want to get more points for anything, I suppose you just want to do more of that particular thing. Like if you wanted to get up your power or whatever, you just go around. Whoa, this guy's got a weapon. He just throw that at me? Pretty sure he just threw that at me. No. Right, I'm out of stamina now. Let's uh, jog on back a little bit. Yeah, he had a weapon there. I kind of want to see what weapon he had. Oh, head pop. Where did it go? What is it? Just a plane hammer. Can uh, get that out. I can repair this weapon I've got out now too, but... What else have I got? Uh, I don't know. Everything's looking a little bit weak. We need some new weapons, guys. We need to start searching stuff. Whoa, 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 whoa. Not standing in that. It's bad for my health. I don't one of these big guys here. I really don't like them. I don't like me much either, I don't think. <clears throat> right, see if I can find one of these goddamn lockboxes. Let's scan around a little bit. Uh, nothing here. Let's just keep moving. Let's stay away from that big guy. Oh, shit. Sounds like a plan to me. Let's go. 149 meters to the objective. I'm going to do this one. I think I'll go and check out some side missions after that. Some of you were talking... A little bit about that. What's going on here? Are they enemies? I think they're like sort of bad guys, right? But we won't deal with them for now. We'll get side initially in a little while. Wish me oh, wait, luck, what? kid. Good luck, brother. You're going to need it. That's one of the side missions, right? But we'll get to that shortly. I think. Uh, hopefully, I can come back to that. Or I don't know if I can. Let me check the uh, the quest log at the moment. Uh, it's something to do with needs a gun. Mother's Day. Oh, that one was for what's his name? Is it? I forget his fucking name. The young one. Is it Brahim or something like that? Are you? Hey, stupid! Hey, this weapon's going south quickly. We are yet to find any decent weapons. It seems. I'm not really looking around too much. I suppose we should do more side stuff for that. 
smashed it. Fucking bitch, done. Gotta love that. Love how you can just slam the fuck out of zombies when they're on the floor. It's great. Ooh. What's in there? Don't know. There's a few zombies around. Airdrop stolen. Ah, oh, okay. I see. That's what that is. An airdrop. I see. That's the first one I've come across. I think. Oh shit! I'm gonna go do this mission for Rice in the dark. Let's hope I don't die today. Anyway, this is the way. Don't shoot! Don't shoot! Hands up! What the fuck do you want? I'm here to see Rice. Brecken sent me. Rice. Brecken? That asshole in the tower? All right. What does he want? I've come to make a deal. <laughs> what kind of deal? The kind I make with Rice, not with his flunkies. All right. Let him through. This ought to be entertaining. These guys have got guns. I have a pipe. <laughs> So we're just jumping over. I guess so. I'm in a safe zone. That'll do me while it's night time. Okay. Co-op mode is uh, now open. I might try and work some of that out with one of my friends, actually. Get to come on and do a couple of co-op missions. Probably won't do commentary, but... Unless, I can, unless Landon's got it, actually. I'll see, I should see if Landon's got this game. That'd be kind of cool. How long have we been friends, Osman? We have been friends for a very long time. Why I'm so surprised that you would steal from me? Haven't I seen you somewhere before? Now I give you a choice. Very simple. Your right hand or your left. Left. Oh. Was that my left or your left? I was going to say he took his right there, didn't he? Bastard. You have the look of the tower about you. What do you want? I'm here to make a deal. A deal. For fantasy, no doubt. Desperate times. And what do you offer in return? Hmm? Your services? Your loyalty? Perhaps I should take both. Talk to Karim. He's one of ours. Do what he asks of you, and Rise will consider giving your people some Anthazin. Understood? I don't seem to have a choice. Perceptive. Shit. I'm gonna take this rusty reed knife. I'm gonna take it. <clears throat> what about this guy's hand? My left or your left? <laughs> okay, so we gotta speak to that guy over there. Let's just have a little look around here first, see what's going on. It is night time at the moment, so I'm glad I'm in a safe zone. Don't you look at me like that. Don't you fucking open up your arms. Like you want to go. And start something. Just because you're surrounded with like 50 of you guys. <laughs> and yeah, I'd be in a bit of a trouble if I started something in here, I think. I met Rice, and Jade's right. He's a psychopath. He's also the GRE's rogue operative. Now I've got to cooperate with this piece of shit. Not only because of my mission, but also because he's got a ton of antizen stockpiled. Okay, so I need to keep my eyes open for those blue things on the map for more drops in the future. Completely ignored that one that came in, but never mind. There'll be more, I'm sure. Okay. Probably want to attack those when I've got better weapons, and then I can maybe take on the guys that are trying to get it too. But anyway, let's speak to Karim. There you are. Rai said you'd be coming by. I'm Karim. Crane. An American. I have an uncle there. Lives in Texas. You from Texas? You a cowboy? I'm from Chicago. Okay, Al Capone. We'll be in constant <laughs> contact over the radio. That way I can make sure you get where you need to go. And where's that exactly? You're going to be climbing antenna towers and switching on shortwave radio modulators. Most of my men are too slow, too fat, or too drunk to climb a tower like that without killing themselves. And if I do this, I'll get the answers in? That's between you and Rice. I know better than to speak for him. Just don't fail. He doesn't handle disappointment very well. Okay, so... Why now? Contact the GRE. Okay, let's go do that. So I'll do this mission. I don't know if I'm going to have to go do something for uh, Kareem in the meantime, but uh, try and get this mission done, then I'll go and do some side stuff, I guess. Just met a guy named Kareem. He's like Rice's major domo, I guess. 
Or number one flunky at the very least. Kareem's sending me to fix some antennas for Rice. Nothing better than being an errand boy. No, you said it. Okay, so it's night time at the moment, which I guess means we yeah, do we want to go outside? Have we got to go outside to contact these guys? Yeah, I think we have. Okay. So I guess then we want to be careful doing this. Unless there's a, I don't know if there's a bed around here. We've just got normal guys going around. I don't know where the volatiles are going to be, but... Oh god, this might end badly for us. So we'll, uh, I don't know if we'll like come back here. If we freaking die or whatever, but whatever. Let's just go. Let's just do this thing. Let's get into the night time. Boink. Let's go contact that GRE. We can come back to this safe room. It's not that far off by the looks of things. Put my flashlight on here. Uh, I need to climb this crap, I think. Alright. Let's go. Get up on this. Yeah, there we go. This looks like it'll do. Crane. Report. Just met Rise. There's no question, that's Suleiman. Guy's a psychopath. He's gone from ruthless politician to fucking warlord. Is he aware of your affiliation with us? No. He thinks I'm just a guy from the tower. In fact, he's making me jump through hoops before he'll give me any antizen. Acknowledged. Continue to do as he asks. Remember, we need that file. Great. Crane out. Okay. Night is here. Kind of, uh... I don't know. We should, I want to stay out for a bit. I mean, I could die here. I don't really care if I do. But... Yeah, I don't know what's going to go down with the uh, volatiles or whatever. There's one over there behind me. <clears throat> Probably looking for me at the moment, but... Let me check out the map here and see where it is we've actually got to go to. Uh, so it's like round on the right. Oh, it's quite far off. Shit. <clears throat> yeah, I'm, I'm kind of... I don't know. Anxious to stay out of the night a little bit. I just want to... Stay out. No, out of the way. Get back. Ooh. Need to repair this guy. I might just quickly whip out some new stuff. I guess I got a couple of I got a new hammer there, and all of this stuff is kind of whack, right? So we'll put that on there. And where's that rusty reed knife? I was I want to try that out. It's like the first blade we've got, really. Let's have a look at it. They're all coming. You know, like it. I'm getting more points too. Like Twenty-eight points per kill. These guys are shouting. I don't know if that. Oh, that allows the other guys. Ready I'm ready. Exactly I was born ready, baby. Doing? Radio communication has been pretty spotty in the quarantine. These modulators will help boost the signal so Rise can communicate with Atlas at the far reaches of town. It's a benefit for everyone, not just Rise. Perhaps. But the Emperor must monitor his empire. Where's my uh, UV light? I need to get that equipped. There's a volatile right around here somewhere. <laughs> Turn my flashlight off. Oh shit! What's that bitch? Get away. Get away. Go on, get back. Oh shit! Mash! Get off! I wonder if I can kill these guys. I'm kinda, I'm kinda, I kinda wanna kill them. I need a trap, I think. Oh shit! It's chasing me! <laughs> Fuck away from me. Go on. Leave me alone. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they're all bright behind me right now, guys. <laughs> Shit! Fuck away! Get away! <gasps> no! Nah! Keep running! <laughs> oh god, dead end! Don't you dare corner! They're, they're trying to cut me off behind me. I can hear them all. No! Normal zombies too. No! <laughs> god, do not go out at night, Jesus! Ugh! Use your survivor sense in the minimap to avoid being spotted by volatiles. So, not the best idea to take those guys on. Let's see where it brings me back now. Oh, let's bring me back in here, that's okay. So, we should probably wait it out until it's uh, mornings. I really don't feel like I've got uh, another survival point to spend on power or skill point. What's this one for? Multi throw, throwing weapons, stunning enemies. Yeah, we'll get that one, why not? Kickstun. 
Sounds useful. So yeah, I, get, I need to get some more practice in before I go out at night again, I reckon. I mean, you can just stick to the daytime if you want to, just by sleeping. I guess I'll do that for now, but... I guess when you get stronger, that's not the way to go. But now that that's done, let's go get this mission sorted, and then we'll go... and, uh... do these side missions, I guess, because some of you are asking for those. Can we get out this way, or have I got to go around? Unless I can climb this pole. Yeah, I guess we've got to go around. Okay, so let's head out of here. Go and find one of these telecommunication antennas. This way. Jump over there, please. There we go. Oh, a drop coming. Should we go take a look at that before it disappears? We could do. We haven't done it yet. New experiences. Oh, shit. Excuse me. What's going on, zombies? I'm going for a drop, so you're going to have to leave me alone. So I wonder if the... Let's go! Fucking have it! It's blocking me. Back up from him and get my energy back. And you want it as well? Okay, let's do it now. I think that guy was like sat down or whatever. Missed me. Oh, I missed him too. Come on then, let's go. Come on. Bitch! How come the zombies aren't going after them? That's some BS. They're just turning away. That'd be really cool if I could, like, use them as a weapon too, like they come and chomp them in the back. Come on. I'm on fire now. This guy's got to be nearly dead. I've hit him loads of times. Come on. Blocked him there. Oh, fucking throwing knife me, you son of a bitch. Come on, zombie, grab him up. Zombies don't even care about these guys. Ah. He's coming for me, though. Yeah, I don't even think... No, this isn't even the drop. <clears throat> Drop's like over here. I was thinking that thing was... Oh, maybe it is the drop. Ow. Well, it's disappeared now. Urgh. That must have been the drop then. Those two guys disappeared by the looks of things. That was weird. I saw this other arrow over here and thought this was it. How far off is this? Because it's like the other direction to my objective, pretty much. Fucking hell, it's like the other side of the map. Yeah, screw that. I'm not going all the way over there for that. I guess we should just go and deal with this telecommunication thing. I'm not going to spend too much time doing that. We'll work on that when I'm doing side missions if I see one, I guess. Disappointed. Right. <clears throat> so it tells me the strength of my weapon down there on the right, I've noticed. And we can repair it if we want to. This isn't a very powerful one, though. I just wanted to try out a blade for a while. I want to get like a nice machete or something and put a mod on it. I need to keep my eyes open for blueprints. I really should have scanned inside Race's base. But it's all good. I'm going to have to go back there at some point, I'm sure. Right. Okay. Hello, guys. <laughs> no, no. You stay down. Thank you. Whoa. So I'm near a safe zone, try and secure it. Alright. Why not? Are there just going to be enemies here, or zombies, or what? I take it we have to climb? Got to be a way in here somewhere, right? Just tells me to go up. I guess we're going to have to go up to clear it, but... Don't want to get into that too much yet. This guy... Are you still alive? I was going to say, you have no head, no arms. Still standing. <laughs> like a boss. Right, let's go and do this telecommunication antenna. I'm going to do some more exploring after this. Just keep going. I'm getting really sidetracked and stuff. <laughs> that drop's still over there, though. Those drops are coming in like crazy at the moment. Oh, shit, hello. Big fucking fire, man. Oh, he hit me with that. I swear I dodged it. Get him. Let's go. Get away from him. I'm not taking him on yet. No freaking way. They're all over the place, these guys. What's the white drop? Hmm, what is that? Airdrop stolen? Never watched this one. Ooh, shouldn't be walking in this. What is it? That's the drop. There's the drop. Does that even hurt these guys? He's just taking it. There's gotta be uh, some way to turn this electricity off, I guess. It's not happy, is he? Hmm. 
I'm gonna have to lure these guys, these guys away, regardless. I know they're definitely not happy. It's hurting them though, because that guy just this guy's just taking it though. Doesn't fuss him. I want this drop. Ah! Screw it. Let's keep going. Concentrate on what I'm doing. <laughs> Most of the way now. Most the of the way down now, I think. If the power's not on, you'll have to turn it on. Look at all these zombies. I wonder if I can pick... Are they all just falling over? Oh, so oh crap! 